The 19th Amendment of the United States Constitution is famous for making it illegal to stop any U.S. citizen from voting based on their sex. More specifically, it gave women the right to vote. The 19th Amendment came about because of a women's suffrage movement in the U.S. which fought for women's right to vote at state and national levels. The 19th Amendment essentially overruled a former unanimous ruling by the U.S. Supreme Court that the 14th Amendment did not make it legal for women to vote in elections. Senator Aaron A. Sargent first introduced the 19th Amendment to Congress in 1878, but it wasn't until 1920 that it was ratified. If you wonder why I said that, this song is about facts. Facts only, sir. I'm only speaking facts only. Only, sir. Let's get it. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Yeah. Man, I'm spitting straight facts. Yeah. Man, I'm spitting straight facts. They got L-U-K-E on the track. Yeah. Cause I'm spitting straight facts. Damn it. Man, I'm spitting straight facts. Econ, man, I'm spitting straight facts. Yeah, man, I'm spitting straight facts. Yeah, we got L-U-K-E on the track. These are strong facts about the foundations of government. Government is the institution through which a society makes and enforces its public policies. Public policies, all of the things the government decides to do. Legislative power. The power to make laws to frame public policies. Executive power. The power to execute, enforce, and administer laws. Judicial power. The power to interpret laws. In the United States, we live in a democracy. A system of government by the whole population or all the eligible members of a state, typically through elective representatives. The federal government. It's composed of three distinct branches, the legislative, executive, and judicial, whose powers are vested by the U.S. Constitution and the Congress, the President, and the federal courts, including the Supreme Court, respectively. There are three branches in the government that have distributed power. The legislative power has the power to make laws and to frame public policies. The executive power. They have the power to execute, enforce, and administer laws. And the judicial power, they have the power to interpret the laws and break down the laws. Economics is simply the branch of knowledge concerned with the production and consumption and transfer of wealth. And that's a fact. A consumer, a person who purchases goods and services for their personal use. And that's a fact. Scarcity, the state of being scarce or in short supply. In other words, a shortage. That's a fact. A want is a desire to possess or have something or something to wish for. And that's a fact. Yeah, man, I'm spitting straight facts. Yeah, man, I'm spitting straight facts. They got L U K E on the track. Yeah. Cause I'm spitting straight facts. Government, man, I'm spitting straight facts. Econ, man, I'm spitting straight facts. Yeah, man, I'm spitting straight facts. We got L U K E on the track. Okay, cool. What's up? The action of helping and doing work for someone gets the benefit of an advantage to someone or something. Trade, the action of buying and selling goods and services. Stock, the goods of merchandise kept 
on premises of a business or warehouse in a self stock exchange, a market in which securities are bought and sold. So just like add that to the project and you know, put it in the song. Oh yeah, we good then. Okay. All right. Well, I'll talk to you later. Okay. Bye. Bye.